Today I'm shooting on the Leica Q2 and I didn't anticipate doing video. I just came up here to Mentrivo to shoot some photos to test it out and I decided you know what I want to talk about something that I'm very excited about and it's something that I'm going to see in just a few days. Well I'm going to see it this week coming up and it's part of the tour so let's talk about it. So what I want to talk about is what I'm going to be riding on tour. What I've been riding for the last several months is the Harley Davidson Pan America. Uh, it's an awesome on-road bike. It's an awesome off-road bike. Uh, it does really well. A friend of mine works with Harley Davidson training people how to off-road properly on these bikes. That's what he does. And so I jumped in and got one and, you know, have been off-roading on it. A bunch of videos about that. But what I want to talk about is something that's even more exciting because Poison is about to launch a tour with Motley Crue, Def Leppard, Joan Jett. Um, and it is about to start in a few days. And I am taking a Triumph out with me. I decided that I wanted to work with Triumph and I asked them if they would be interested in working with me and they said we can have a discussion about that but the first thing we want to do is we want to get you on a bike for the distinguished gentleman's ride because I don't think you were going to ride a Triumph on that ride and I said well I guess I am now so I took a Speedmaster and I have that a link to that video but what I'm going to take out on the road is a Scrambler XE And that is the more off-road version of the Triumph Scrambler. It is freaking awesome. It is one of the, I mean, I just think, I mean, besides the Thruxton and the Bonneville, I think the Scrambler is just one of the pinnacles of that brand. The Scrambler somehow fits this really cool retro thing. I think the main thing is, is the adventure starts when you leave your garage. Or in my case, I'll be leaving the trailer that is attached to my bus. Now, would I do a Neo Peart and ride the whole tour? I would if I could, but we have too many shows in a row in some markets and uh, I, I couldn't do it. I'd never sleep, uh, but Rush had more time in between shows. So I'm excited about this bike. I'm really excited, I can't tell you. I mean, it's just gonna be amazing. But right now, being here in Mentryville, one of the spookiest places in all of Santa Clarita um, with unsolved murders and all kinds of stuff, which Lauren Parker and I plan on working on. Let's just, uh, Let's take a look around. Let's do some photos. Have a look at my photos.
I've used the Q, the regular Q, when I did an episode in Woodstock. I had a Sony camera, the battery died, and I wound up using uh, the Q that I had just to do, you know, just snapshots. And it worked pretty good. Um, but supposedly, uh, for one thing, this has much more resolution. It's 47 megapixels, and the audio is supposed to be a little bit better, and the focus is supposed to be a little bit better, but in certain modes. <laughs> Anyway, I'm really looking forward to not only this tour, but to taking this Triumph Scrambler XE out and doing all the things that I do when I'm here, uh, and that is go out on the motorcycle and uh, explore urban legends. This tour is going to be awesome. It's definitely a moment in time. It's going to be historical in many ways, certainly for everybody that's involved or anybody that comes. I feel like we're all really very excited about that. Uh, one other question, I think that I may go back to Ricky Rocket's legend tripping because I still am enamored by urban legends and that's really the thrust of what I do. I do like paranormal, so Ricky Rocket's paranormal, the vision is pretty cool. And I don't have to really give up either name, I guess, but really helps with the YouTube algorithm. So here's the other thing. I have another channel called The Poison Drummer, and that is all things to do with tour and drums and uh, just everything else. I'm trying to focus this channel more on uh, this kind of stuff, uh, legend tripping. Although I am talking about a motorcycle here, but the motorcycle is going to be uh, really important for those things that I do, those uh, excursions and adventures that I go on. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and ring the bell. And by the way, when you subscribe, you don't get spammed. It's just when you go on YouTube, you can look at who you subscribe to and it'll tell you if you have new videos. Everybody freaks out about subs, like it's like you're gonna get spammed or they're gonna have like your number or something. <laughs> it's nothing like that. It's just to let you know when the person uploads new videos. Anyway, take care of each other and keep rock alive.